All right. Good morning. This episode of How to Draw Duty Live is brought to you by Story Comic Podcast. Story Comic is a podcast that focuses on the people behind the words. The host, Bonnie Smith, interviews comic creators of all types and their works and tells stories about comics, comic big stories, and all other forms of pro storytelling. We've been streaming our show online since late 2019, and it's been amazing to see how many people around the world have come to appreciate the value of hearing stories from people who are just as passionate about their work as we are. So if you're a comic creator yourself, or you know someone who is, or if you just want to hear about how your favorite comic book got made, come check us out, storycomic.com. Welcome to Hi to Draw Duty Live. Today we'll be drawing duty as vast as Stampede. So let's get this party started. Hi, I'm Vera. Wait, hold on. I'm Vera. Well, we're both Veras. Anyway, welcome to Drawing Duty, where I take my favorite character, Duderi Shuranius, from There's an Alien in My Toilet, and I put him in all sorts of costumes, from your most iconic characters to just a pirate or even uh, Thundercats or a bandit. Well, every day I take duty and I have fun. And I'm glad that you're here to have fun with me. If you have time, please check out dutiesworld.com. And if you like this episode and every episode before it, please subscribe, like, and share. Thank you so much. And let's start drawing. All right. Welcome, everybody, to another episode of uh, How to Draw Duty Live. Have you signed up for the launch of Disney in my toilet, book number three? I hope that you do. If you enjoy my work, um, you definitely will enjoy book number three. Coming to Kickstarter in... Um, 15 days. We're launching in 15 days. There's two issues. There's Ai Chihuahua and then there's Duties Monsters on Planet Cthulhu. It's going to be a double header. Uh, one is the campaign, which is issue three. And the second one is a stretch goal to unlock and add on. We have to break the threshold. Um, the goal is to reach $2,500 to unlock this book. And uh, I'm actually working on the last two pages right now, which is crazy. So I'm excited about that. So I hope that you join me. And if you're going to be in Texas in October, uh, come and meet me at the Dallas Fan Festival on the 14th through the 16th. I'll be in Artist Alley there. And come to Countdown Comic Con on the 22nd and the 23rd. I'll be there as well. So I'd love to come. Uh, I'd love to meet with you there. So that'd be awesome. So with that said, I'm going to start drawing. I'm going to put on some of the music. Um, and let's get that music going. Do, 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 do. Music's playing. And up to there's an alien on my toilet. Book number three, I Chihuahua. The link is in the chat right now, and it's also in the summary. Uh, so, uh, sneak peek of one of the pages I just finished for Duty's Monsters. Here's a spoiler alert. Boom. There it is. There's a spoiler. That's all you're gonna get. Boom. If you blinked, you missed it. If you if you went to reach for that cup of coffee, you turned your head, you just missed it. You have to rewind. But um, that that was a spoiler. Uh, you want another spoiler? Another sneak peek? Another sneak peek? Here's some uh, pages that I'm penciling right now. Boom. Done. Gone. It's gone, Sam. It's gone. All right. Let's let's get duty going. All right. So. Even though today's a holiday, I gotta get some work done because I need to get this Duties Monsters book to the printers by no later than Tuesday, Tuesday night. So today I gotta finish the last two pages and then um, um, and then um, send off to get the proofs because I want the proofs for their live launch. I'm hoping to have the proof for the live launch. So there's no guarantee that I'll have the proof for the live launch, but you know, the goal is to have them. So, so I'm using the, um, the, the resin action figure or the action figure pose. Uh, as my um, as my reference, the model. Right. But remember, duty. Also, gonna have the belly, so I'm just gonna add the belly onto this. 
Um, again, another day I didn't work out. Somehow I got to figure out how to get myself motivated to work out. I think it's because I have these deadlines um, and I know I won't be able to get all this work done when I go back to work. So I just want to get it all out the way. Um, I don't know if any of you have watched the new um, Lord of the Rings, man, but that's wow. Visually stunning. Um, it is just gorgeous. It is just gorgeous. Uh, uh, the storytelling is funny. Um, I gotta start memorizing names because, you know, if I want to talk about the uh, Lord of the Rings, I gotta remember the characters. But anyway, the Prince Dwarf, um, his his friend, I thought that was pretty pretty hilarious. That um, his heart was broken. That his buddy wasn't there for the birth of his child, uh, for his wedding. Uh, I thought they played that off really well. Um, You know, actually, this I want to see over here. So I want this here. All right. Well, I had to lock my door, my uh, my because every time I'm drawing my dog. Um, you know, they uh, act up. And then yesterday, the little mongrels, one of them, I don't know which one it was, peed in the hallway. So. Uh, so now, uh, it's like, you know what? At the gate there, I can't come up now. He has, he has crazy stuff. Um, so as I'm doing this, I'm deciding, do I want to get all that stuff? Yeah. I'm excited because uh, my sister comes um, in two days. You know, got to see my in-laws. They were here. Uh, then my sister's coming. Uh, it's pretty dope. Um, right before I go back to work, everybody's showing up, spend some time. Pretty cool. And my phone's on fire this morning. It's like everybody woke up. He's got this jacket. Of course, I had to pick something that has so many... Uh, little twist to it. Okay, it's just a...
It's got these little lock stuff or whatever. Oh, I don't like that one there. It's gonna be over here, so. And he's got about two of those, and then he has this uh like an elbow pad type thing here. Alright. Put that in there. It's got the dang glove on. So get this going here. He's got all these locks, so I see there's one here. He has one here. And then he has uh, another one here. All right, he's got these little straps and stuff. He's got another one here. Straight up rocker. Straight up rocker. You know, when I was, um, that's. So it was funny because you know you don't realize now it's clicking right as I'm as I'm as I'm illustrating this um, when I was a kid if you uh, there was a lot of guys that were like rockers but they used to look like this and I didn't realize that they were getting this influence from this from this character now it makes sense I said, oh my God, I see the way you shine. Okay, so this is like a, like a vest type thing, right? So this is, this goes here. And here's one in the back. All right, so that one in the back is a little darker, right? So I just want to shade that for reference. It's got the, uh, so that goes down the center. Okay. All right, boom. It's got all these little buttons. The buttons there then he has on this button here he has like a, a belt but here because he has this belt that goes here right and then that one can go around okay So this would go like boom, boom, boom. I just shade that just for a second. All right, and then he's got this. That's Same thing on this side, just got this. We'll do that like that. Let's get this. Okay, it's coming along. Uh, 
so only on one arm does he have those straps so he doesn't have it on this arm so that's good but he has like um three three rings like uh uh oh four here's four of them All right Ready for war. All right, he's got three of them, right? So we got one, two, three. Boom, boom. Got some rivets there. And then he's got some um, straps and stuff. And then he's got a, uh, this one here, right? And he's got straps. He has like a like the straps on the legs. Let's just get those straps going there. And then the buckles of the boots. Uh, he's got that knee cap, that knee brace, right? For the most part, we got the design for duty. Uh, am I missing anything? Let's, let's uh, get this. Uh, so should I add duty with hair? With the hair? Maybe like... Maybe just those two pieces right there. Right, let me go add the hair. Uh oh, it's getting down, it's coming down. Let's see. They got a shout out to JD Calderon who's launching the Oswald Chronicles today on Kickstarter. Uh, he's working with a fantastic team of artists, which is crazy. I mean, they're really doing a great job on his book. So there's the sketch for duty as Vash. Oh, let me I need to see my coffee. But you didn't. It took about 20 minutes to do that sketch. I'm now timing myself because uh, I got to start uh, purging some of the videos on my uh, street yard. Not unless you do 50 hours worth of videos stored. So um, I have to uh, purge. 
So he has those glasses, they're orange. Oh, oh let me, um... Oh, what am I doing? That's what I'm doing. So if this is... Alright, there it is. Alright, he has the glasses. JT Calderon just launched. I mean, kudos to him for launching on a holiday. Uh, you know, it's most people like getting ready for um, yeah, popcorn and stuff. I mean, barbecue and you know, it's like a originally I was going to launch this week um, Labor Day and I was like ah oh, it's a holiday and um, you know uh, I'm not going to do it on a holiday uh, you know but uh, you know good for him
He has a he has gloves on with some sort of spikes. I didn't even see that. <sighs> and some sort of spikes around his like uh did here. I gotta fix that in a second. I'm gonna race here. Alright, let's uh there. Now I can close that up. So I realize I gotta find a better way. Either a better chair or uh, or something better because I've been hurting my neck in this position. So I have to either reposition my table lower, but my neck, I always walk away with really bad neck cramps um, after I'm done drawing.
There's two parts here. Okay, let's get the boots. Steel toe boots were the craze in my neighborhood.
All right, let's get rid of the pencils for a second so I can see there's openings. Close all those openings. Erase areas that I don't want. So the good thing is that it's red and black is the, the primaries. So it's not like a whole lot of uh, crazy colors. I right, to be dropping in there. Like everything's red. All the straps are red. All right, so let's get this going. Even those straps are red. Crazy. But this is black. All this is black and silver here. The gloves are black. The pants are black. Okay. Clean up those uh, areas real quick. I got a lot of white spaces I gotta fill in. Well, let's go in. Now I gotta unsubscribe to a lot of these things. I get so much spam. It's crazy. You know, I support a lot of Kickstarters, but but because I support a lot of Kickstarters, uh, I always decline for their newsletters because my I mean I already have so many emails already just from Cast to Craze podcast from creators that um, and that already clogs up my inbox. Uh, I just can't have all of these other emails coming in from all over the place it just takes forever to go through it all and purge really those buttons are gray so I'm gonna take that same red and put a little darker for inside. Well, maybe a little darker than that. Yeah, darker than that. Yeah.
Okay. Cool. So we got that. Now let's do the silver or the gray, and then we'll do the blacks. I'm going to do them all in separate layers. Let's get that gray in there. Let me zoom in. So gray is all the buttons and the buckles and the gun. Oh, look at that, I forgot that strap. Knuckle press knuckle things here. Ah, oh, man, Sam. All right, let's. Let's uh, fix those things real quick. I did it up here too. Anywhere else they do it? All right, let's go back. Maybe a lighter gray for. Let me get this in there. Let me clean those up. Okay, I'll do a lighter. Great for these uh, these bad boys down here, right? And then they're gonna be like a Is, oh, those straps are gray. Oh, and then on here he has. He has those. And then. And then those straps are gray. And then. Alright. So those are darker gray, those straps. I got a dark gray. Let's go. Straps are black, that's black. And I, what I forgot to do here is get these. Okay, so those are done. So the gloves black, everything else is black. So we'll do that in a separate layer.
pen this traps, which is crazy. Alright. Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna make it. I'm gonna. I want the straps to be seen a little bit. Just gonna lighten those up a little bit. Silverish. That's this gun going. This is docking. Oh, jeez. In the middle. Everything else is one. Everything's one color. layers just for the outfit. Now let's get duty's skin color. There's duty. There you go, let's pull. Let me zoom in. Holes, there it is. Glasses are orange. Let 
the frame is black this And the hair is like um it's like an off yellow. I do want to say thank you to the 120 uh, supporters that signed up for the launch of uh, book number three on Kickstarter. I mean, it's a record for duty and myself. I mean, this is my, let's see, the three, three, and three this is my ninth campaign. And that's the most people that's ever signed up for any of my campaigns. And uh, so we're so excited and eternally grateful. Thank you so much for taking a chance and going on this trip and journey with us. I truly appreciate your support. All right, so there's the the flats so the flats took wow the flats took 40 minutes the sketching no actually no no the sketching took 20 minutes the, i think it's 20 i don't know whatever All right, let's go and add some uh, multiply guys doing today barbecuing what's going on um, see my holiday begins when my sister gets here so that's why I'm doing this as a work day because my family comes over I put things aside and spend time so today is a work day for me and you know, I think for me it's like the holiday is what you, you choose it to be so um, Whatever it is, you know, you gotta make it work for you. Uh, go back up. And then Texas heat, really not conducive to a uh, barbecue. Texas barbecue, yeah, I'm gonna do it from indoors. <laughs> this is, uh, this heat is on another level. Yesterday we got a reprieve. Um, this storm came out of nowhere. I mean, it was just like boom, 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 and this torrential downpour it just came. I mean, there was no warning. Dobbs Ferry, New York. Can't take that call right now, my brother, because I'm in the middle of drawing. I think it's my buddy Jonathan calling me. But uh, I'm in the middle of uh, this live stream. Johnny, if you're out there, I'm on the live stream. So if you want to chat on the live stream, you know, chat with me here until I'm done.
Happy birthday to Andy Pablo Williams from Pollos. Voicemail. There's the voicemail. supposed to get like torrential downpours for a, a minute um, in a second so if I do please excuse me I'm gonna try not to be like one of those crazy loud hot shoes like my wife when my wife sneezes it's like a scream it's like ah, it's a, and she's like 411 but her sneeze man when I sneeze I uh, put my my face in my shirt like I lift my shirt up and I put my face in my shirt so I'm covering myself up especially if I'm in public yeah I do it when I'm home but especially if I'm in public because you know I don't want you know anybody saying yo yo you have sneeze death you wear right you cover up I was like <laughs> no I, I cover up this way no one can say anything no particles anywhere it's inside my shirt You know? Good thing I closed that door because now my, my dogs are barking. And I'm sure you can hear them. All right. <laughs> um. Just got a message that someone else just signed up to my uh, campaign. That's awesome. Thank you, sir. I love the support. If you have kids um, and you're looking for something fun, um, all ages, comedy, with an educational twist, because every issue of There's Nailing My Toilet. Um, has trivia questions and puzzles and stuff. Interactive, very interactive. You know, inspiring education and, and uh, learning. Um, and uh, please take a chance on Disney in my toilet. You won't be disappointed. You know, there's so much content out there and I get it. But not enough content in my opinion. It's just one man's opinion for the little ones. So, I'm representing the little ones. We're going in. The little ones need love too, bro. And a lot of it has to do with the fact that when I was a kid, uh, uh, I love the kind of content that I create. You know, so. I was trying to get this done in an hour. 
But because he has this so much red, it's not gonna take it's gonna be longer than an hour. But because I have the last two pages of do these monsters to do today. And then then I have to letter well from drawing and coloring, then I have to letter those bad boys. Um uh, and then proofread everything. So once I finish lettering it, then I'm gonna go back and you know edit it, proofread it, make sure there's no typos, make sure um, I didn't uh, miss something. Always double, always inspect your work. That's what I said. You know, and always send for proofs. You know, um, I made the mistake once and I didn't send for a physical proof. And uh, like when I got back the quality, I was so upset because I lost money on that. I had to reprint everything and I lost money because it was my fault. I didn't uh, do my due diligence and um, get a proof. All right, so I think that's the gist of that. Oof. All right, now let's go to, what's this? This is the silver, right? All right, let's go into that. Multiply. Zoom in. Let's go to settings. Hey, what's up, Spider? I see these wherever I want to. Nice artwork. I got my sister a stuffed animal that she wanted. Oh, that's cool. You see these wherever you want to. That's just gross. Nah, I gotta cover it all up. Uh -uh. Don't need any drama outside. There's a lot of people out there ready to go post on people. Everyone's looking for an excuse uh, in the streets for, for uh, to rise up and uh, attack somebody. I'd rather just keep everything PC. <laughs> yeah, that's the best thing, bro. I was like, cover up. Um, I have a buddy of mine. He doesn't even know how to cover up. He's just a savage when he sneezes. It's just like, run. As soon as he starts making that move with his face, he's like, ha, ha, ha. That's it. Run for the border because he's going to get you. And then he'll make an excuse. Oh, I didn't have time to cover my mouth. It happened so quickly. And I'm like, I just saw you make your motion. I saw your your, your head tilt back, your, no, your mouth open, your eyes closed. You had plenty of time because I I took evasive action. I said, all right, it's coming in. The evasive maneuvers is about to blow.
<laughs> Spider-Man as Deadpool. Spider-Man as Deadpool. So, um, hmm, that's interesting. <laughs> Try to wrap my head around that one because they both have tights. Uh, spider, yeah, I'm trying to figure how that would work, yeah. Have you seen the new one? Lord of the Rings? I'm not sure if you're into Lord of the Rings at all, but the series on Net on Amazon is crazy. It's fire. I'm loving every minute of it. It just started. This uh, has two episodes right now on um, Amazon Prime. Uh, it is awesome. The visual effects, you know, this uh, is crazy. I've been watching that in She-Hulk. Um, yeah, you need to see it. I mean, it is. Whew, like they really. I mean, you can see how much this costs because they put a lot of money into this. The, the, the visual effects itself is just on a whole nother level. to be. Sit down. It's okay. <laughs> that's usually, Bentley, relax. That's usually, um, that's a good Hey, come here. Stop it. That's usually a good way to uh, do it deal with the fact that you don't like spiders just uh it's a good way to uh, combat that like i know i knew somebody hey come on i'm trying to draw ah. i knew somebody who uh, was afraid of heights and uh and uh, uh decided to go skydiving to combat that fear I was like, well, that's a, that's a good way of uh, dealing with it. Um, it's hard for me to focus with this. My, my, my mongrel acting up. Yeah, three dogs? What kind?
Yeah. Um, I hear you. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I have uh, this one that's barking. He's a Shih Tzu. Uh, and I have a uh, Afghan Wolfhound Shepherd mix. And uh, a Yorkie and a Chihuahua. Face multiply.
What's up? Do you uh, uh, do you draw, uh, or are you just game? Oh, nice. What, what, uh, like, what do you like to draw? What are you into? <coughs> Bentley, please. We just had that conversation, bro. Nice. Yeah, I like watching Jake Parker. I don't know if you know who Jake Parker is. He has really good drawing videos. Oh, Ninja Turtles, nice. My boy is a huge Ninja Turtles fan. Um, I have two of the Ninja Turtles art books, the art of the Ninja Turtles books. But my boy's like, uh, I'm actually, he actually commissioned me to do a, a painting of my character duty of a Ninja Turtle that I'm working on now. Um, but he's like, Anything turtles, he's he's that's the, he's loves that stuff, and I love the turtles too, but he's like a super mega fan, and I'm I'm like a casual fan. I only have one. F oh, the art of book. Yeah, yeah. I have. Uh, I don't know where. Where's my? I have that one. Uh, I have the uh, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles art biography, the Kevin Eastman version, and I also have um, ah here it is. So I have the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Ultimate Visual History. I don't know what it is. Oh, right there, in that little thing. And that. Uh, oh. I only have. Oh, I only ha I have the art of books, not art of videos. But uh, on YouTube, there's a uh, Jake Parker who has a lot of great YouTube videos on drawing. Um, he's a fantastic artist. Uh, I tend to watch his stuff. I love watching uh, people's process. And then I spend a lot of time um, how-to videos on um, mastering this program that I'm working on from Studio. I know, Microsoft Paint, that's uh, crazy. You know, but I started with Microsoft Paint um, when I started drawing, um, I think uh, everybody does, I, I know. It's almost like using Illustrator when you think about it. I mean, because Microsoft Paint, doesn't it's, it limits you, so you really got to, you know, really, it helps you hone in your skills because, um, you know, you get to, uh, you don't want to make a lot of mistakes with Microsoft Paint because undo features suck. Leo as as Spider Man, you really love Spider Man. I just realized that. Yeah, I think um um I'll put that on the uh, on the on the list. Leo as Spider Man, because I don't have to think about how it's gonna look.
There you go. Yeah, I'm actually working off of a PC right now. Um, I use a PC because my tablet is hooked up to the PC. Uh, the new Macs make it hard with these with the tablets because um, they don't have too many ports, so you have to buy all these adapters and add-ons. I didn't have to do that with the PC, so it's actually a Dell laptop. that um, I'm drawing off of. <laughs> yeah, you're making my brain go crazy. <laughs> That's all right. It's like I'm trying to figure out looks. Um, there's a lot of different looks. It could be uh, just this. That's not bad. Is drawing is drawing for you a passion or a hobby?
Oh, sorry to hear that. Yeah, getting sick is no fun. I got sick uh, about two months back, and it was no fun. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I got a sick. I got sick at a convention, and it followed me home. And I and I was sick for it's like ten days. And I was like, "Ah, it's that." Load up on my vitamins, and uh, boom. Oh, I don't know. That's that's horrible. How'd you get through it? That's what we do. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, it's like uh, you can you can prep all you want. Um, it is still tough to get through that stuff. Definitely lots of sleep. Sleep always works. Sleep, sleep's the best remedy. Anyone tell you otherwise are crazy. Which game? Oh, nice.
Thank you, sir. <laughs> well, thank you. Well, I've been enjoying for a long time. Um, and I draw every day. Um, that's the biggest thing. Uh, uh, it's, uh, it's like working out. Uh, if you work out every day, you eventually can start building muscle and stamina. I draw every day at least eight hours a day, um, minimum. And uh, and it helps me. Uh, I'm gonna do. Yeah, I think. Um, I wasn't always that way. Uh, it took me some time away from drawing to realize how much I missed it. And uh, cause I left comics and drawing for a long time for 10, you know, and then uh, I came back. And uh, thank you. And, you know, and drawing for me is like, um, it's like meditation, you know, it's very relaxing. I have the most fun when I'm drawing. Yeah, I think that's it. If you if you love what you do, who cares what anybody else thinks? You know, life is too short. Um, you know, and you gotta follow your heart. And uh, you know, yeah, that's it. You know. Good advice, my friend. Yes. Good advice. Well, this is a uh, duty. Looks like my camera went out. Duty as uh, what happened here? I'm oh, sorry. As Vash and. Uh, Join me here next time, um, where I'll be uh, turning duty into another character. And uh, but uh, if you haven't done so already, uh, guys, uh, um, give me a thumbs up if you like this episode. Uh, subscribe if you haven't done so already. Uh, like, share it with a friend, anybody you know that's into art. Uh, I would love for you to share it. Um, yeah, I see that it says uh, my cat. It happens all the time with this laptop. Let me see. Start camera. camera yeah for some reason my camera is always acting crazy there it is ah there you go thanks buddy yeah, I know you th th thank you and everybody else is watching on Twitch or Facebook or YouTube thank you so much for joining me today and if you haven't done so already sign up for the launch of book number three on Kickstarter 15 days to launch and thank you for the 120 of you who have signed up already we have 15 days and um, part three is going to be a fun fun ride part three of uh, Disney of my toilet plus duties monsters on planet Cthulhu 
So thank you, Spider, for joining me again. Have fun today. Um, get better. And, uh, uh, and keep that gaming spirit and art spirit alive. Let me turn off this music. And I am Samuel, and I am out. Enjoy your holiday, guys. Peace. Hey, don't forget to subscribe. And while you're at it, hit that like button. Share it with a friend. And pick up a copy of this Nail in My Toilet on DutiesWorld.com. See you next time. Have a great day.